And now, the news program that starts your day off right. Good morning, South Park. Good morning, South Park. A new vigilante took to the streets last night and has apparently single-handedly taken down the Famboni crime family. Here with more is a midget in a bikini. Tom, I'm standing outside the Book of Day Fagaccini where the vigilante declared war on crime in South Park. Security camera footage showed a young person farting in people's faces on their balls. It was just terrifying. The kid came in and just started farting on people. It was out of nowhere, man. Maybe someone's finally standing up to what's wrong with this city. This new kid's a hero. The kid's a menace, if you ask me. How long before he or she kills an innocent person? How long before Daredevil becomes the Punisher? Huh? Three seasons? Three seasons! Police called to the scene found a treasure trove of illegal items that they claim might tie the Italian restaurant to a larger crime syndicate. This may be just the tip of the iceberg. Certainly chilling stuff, and there are reports the vigilante possibly had a sidekick? There was thought to be a sidekick, Tom, but further investigation showed it was just some little twerp with diabetes. Thanks, Midget, and of course, the question on everyone's minds now, who is the farting vigilante? This is going to make us look bad. You fucked up. It wasn't our fault. This kid just came into the restaurant and started farting like there was no tomorrow. All you Italians are supposed to do is move the product. The Chinese and Russians do the rest. Everything has to be discreet and quiet or people are gonna learn the truth. That we put the product into people's drugs and alcohol in order to create more crime. You just keep doing your part in getting the cheese out on the streets. Or maybe I'll start dealing directly with the Russians. Or the Chinese. Or the sixth graders. Oh man, what a great sleep. Yeah, I haven't slept that well in weeks. <sighs> so, you guys do anything interesting last night? Oh, no, you know, the usual. Just watched some TV and went to bed. Yep, nothing exciting in our b boring lives. Well then, I guess I'll just be seeing you guys tomorrow. You've got a big day ahead of you, new kid. Get changed into your superhero costume and wait for a message from the king. All right, my lord. It's time for us to get the information we need from Classy. Any good superhero should know how to interrogate. Get over to Jimmy's house and find out what she knows. Keen out. Oh, it's you again. Sup, hero? Don't be farting in my face and shit. Hey, Fast Pass, one of your super homies is here. Oh, hey, new kid. The coon told me he wants you to question the witness, so go ahead, have at it. Go ahead, new kid, ask her anything you want. Oh, that's smart. Using the silent treatment can really make a witness a antsy. I right, look, I know y'all need my help and shit, but I ain't talking to you go get my medication. Y your medication? Yeah, I can't think straight without my medication. You gotta go pick up my prescription, all right? Until you get my prescription, I ain't telling you little heroes fuck all nothing. Well, all right, fine. Looks like you got more work to do, new kid. Ah, new kid. I see you've also come to assist in assuring Classy's cooperation. Please, after you. Uh, hello, we're picking up some medicine for a friend. Oh, is your friend looking for an energizing mental feeling or more of a full body high? Uh, I don't know. Well, I'll send over our expert bud tender who can help you out. Hey, you want to get high? Oh, hey, Eric. Oh, wow, Tally. Thought you went to rehab. Yeah, I did, but now I'm back in South Park. Clean and sober, almost a year. Clean and sober, no drugs at all. And I tell you what, I don't miss it! And you work here in a pot store. Cannabis, Eric, and yeah, it's great. Now I get high, helping people cure their insomnia, back pain, migraines, and stress, naturally. Did you know that ancient Chinese gave cannabis to their infants for teething? Huh. I have an addictive personality, so I'm cool without it. And now I got a kid with my lady, so better to stay on the straight and narrow, you know? You have a kid, right. That turns out I had one the whole time. I was too high to realize. Now I'm holding down a job and paying the rent. But I'm also doing good, helping people find the herbal remedies they need to 
combat all the modern stresses of a job and taxes and traffic and a wife breathing down my neck about an apartment in a town that we got a leak. Why, why can't you fix it? I'm not a plumber, bitch. I'm a towel, not a fucking plumber. Okay, we're, we're here to pick up our friend's medicine. Her name is Classy. Oh, Classy. Yeah, Classy with a Y with a clit hanging off it, coming around and licking the shit out of the sea. No, 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 no. It's uh, Classy with a dick hanging off the eye that's fucking the L out of the ASS. Oh, that Classy. Sure, I got her order. There she is. See, she likes the banana kush for her back pain and some of the platinum OG to wait. What the fuck? Who put the chillax cushion with the OG mellow bliss? What the fuck, you retards? People don't want to mix their mellow with their chill. They'll get all fucked up. God, fuck, 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 fuck. Hey, hey, Tally, it's cool. Relax. No, it is not fucking cool. I'm trying to run a legitimate business here, and my back hurts. I can't sleep. I got no appetite. This shitty town is so fucked up. We got to buy all our product from fucking sixth graders. And who knows what the shit they're putting in it. And then to top it off, I got a couple of little dick liquors coming into my store telling me to fucking relax. Fuck you. You relax. Hey guys, oh, hey, how you been, Eric? Oh, you're a cool guy, man. Oh, I'm psyched to see you, man. Yeah, I threw in a couple hash nuggets and some granddaddy purple shatter on the house. So come by anytime for a hookup. See, here's the new kid now. You got Classy's prescription? Damn well, better hand my prescription. Well, it's about motherfucking time. Praise Jesus, I need this shit bad. If I don't get my medication, I lose my motherfucking mind. You know what I'm saying? All right, all right, all right. That's much fucking better. All right, listen. The place y'all niggas need to go is you store it. That's where they taking the cats. You know what I'm saying? That's it. Coon, this is fast pace. The new kid got the intel from Classy. Not bad, new kid. What'd you find out? It's the used store it in the northeast of town. Classy says the cats are being taken there. The used store it. We should have known. All right, keep Classy safe. I'll get back to you guys soon. Roger that. Fast pass. Uh, uh. Fast pass. Uh, uh. Fast pass. Uh, uh, uh. Fast, fast pass. Fast pass. Fast pass out. New kid, this is the human kite. You know that little problem you helped me take care of? Well, it's back. Can you come to my house ASAP, please? Thanks for coming. It's over here. I'm big! Will you deal with him, please? Look, Cousin Kyle, it's that mean kid who beat me up before. Yeah, oh no, somebody stop him. Don't worry, Cousin Kyle. I have developed these super sensors which will make it almost impossible for him to beat us up this time. I have to stay out of this. Just please, please make him go away. Prepare to meet your doom, evil bully kid. Bravo. Oh, now you've done it. <laughs> okay, okay, that does it. You guys asked for it. And now Human Kite shall use his Hebrew face to call upon the power of the wind. Hikmel Shigina. Let the strength of the wind make my kite fly and... Oh, Jesus, it came off. Oh, Jesus, my kite just blew up into the tree, Cousin Kyle. Then give up. Don't worry, Super Buddy Cousin. Perhaps I no longer have my kite, but I still have my super weapon. <gasps> And Sheila, these kids are picking on me. What, what, what? Who's picking on you? Mom, are you okay? Nice going, guys. Kyle, get inside and call the police. We have to get these kids arrested. No, no, Mom, no police. This is all my fault. What? Look, it's just... I, I couldn't take my cousin copying everything I do. The human kite is about saving people, not about Judaism. And now look at all the damage you've caused. I should press charges against your friends. And look, my kite's up in a tree. I'm sorry. Please, I'll do anything. You are going to let your cousin play with you from now on. Is that clear? Oh boy, Kyle and Sheila says I get to play with you. Yes, sometimes you can play with us. Yippee! Now get your cousin's kite out of that tree. You're not playing anymore until you do. Come on, Shugana. Let's get you some back team. Oh, I hate back team because it gets on my fingers and I get eczema from the lidocaine. Okay, you're approaching the hideout. Find a way in, but be careful. He's probably armed to the teeth. Thermal imaging is showing the suspect is in the rear of the house.
Hey, who are you? What are you doing in my house? Engage! Engage! Holy shit, you're the real deal, superhero. That's one less violent degenerate this town has to deal with. Please come by and help us again. You made a real mistake when you attacked us. You really think you're tough shit, don't you? Well, it's time for you to meet someone. Say hi, Rebecca. I'm gonna break you in half and stick you up my butt. Oh my god. Oh my god. What? A thousand people just disliked the picture of me in ballet class on Instagram. I'm totally getting trolled right now. What the F? Heather, why'd you tweet that I was going out with Eric Cartman? I didn't. I'm totally getting trolled right now, too. What the fuck? What the fuck? I just lost all my followers. I have to get to a computer. What the fuck? What the fuck? Hello, new kid. Don't worry. I'm unfriending their Instagrams exponentially. They won't be back for a while. You gotta be careful playing superhero. You can make a lot of enemies. Some boys think girls don't make good superheroes. What do you think? You think girls are just as good a gamers as you boys? You like to remain mysterious, huh? Fine. Look, you've got problems, new kid. Whatever you did last night got a lot of people's attention. Bad people. There's a crime boss who's been calling the shots here in South Park, and now that person is planning to run for office. Whatever you did last night scared him. I'm tracking everyone's Instagrams and Facebooks and will continue to cross-reference with Tumblr while monitoring Twitter and LinkedIn. If you need information, just know you can rely on Call Girl. Watch your back, handsome!